YouTube, I'm back once again with the uh, long haul. Didn't do all that much mining as I was hoping, because like I was hoping to get a lot more stone. And for me, the the stone out point, uh, the stone output's a little bit less than I anticipated. It's like uh, figure I'm better off going over to the uh, wasteland and just being careful with dogs. You know, just doing some uh, iron upgrades to doors here and. Wow, these take 60 per pop to upgrade, and uh, but so I, so I, under, I vastly underestimated my amount of iron needed for. But it's it'll be good to have these uh, eventually uh, uh, for keeping it all reinforced, and so. What I was thinking to uh, doing today is like, cause my loot respawn is on. Uh, on 10 days, uh, go raid the old crossroads, because uh, I think, I think the crack book's uh, ready to be raided again. And, of course, we got a, a screamer again. Hello. Come here. Take care of her real quick. Hopefully, screamers don't become that much of a problem. Um, let's just do a quick little patrol around the building. We got Bob out here. He's just having his... Morning stroll. We got the nurse and Penny. In case you're wondering about the, uh, the little damage to the uh, to the bathroom of the Cracker Book, that was from a from me knocking out a couple blocks for the wandering horde that came overnight. Felt like taking care of them while I was merging weapon parts and everything like that. And so there's Penny, got Nancy and her sister. Another screamer is rolling around, so... So... I had to deal with these guys for a little bit. Ah, who... Did you really hit me on your way up? Come here. Since you insist it. There we go. Hopefully that was just, uh... That's the last of the scream reaction for now. Come here. Just gotta make sure I take care of these problems here. So I can see you. Good to see you in, in the morning. But yeah, I was wanting to just uh, hit up the motel and then the, um, you know, the good old uh, crack book over there. Maybe finally find the the um, the spike club schematic. I don't know. Yeah, these screamers are just coming around here. Bam. Just. Calm down there, Screamer. Uh, oh, no. Yeah, they're, they're starting to be a little bit of a problem when I run the forge, so... Ow. Annie, come on. Come on. Yeah, these guys are... So let me deal this problem really quick, and I'll meet you guys over at the old crack of book. Ow! Ow. Yep, okay, that's a death. I got stunned. That's my fault, YouTube, so... I was gonna say I was gonna meet over and meet you over the Cracker Book once I was done dealing with them. Thankfully, this is a close death. Although, it's still lost a while just nonetheless, but... Like I was saying, I'll deal with the problem and, uh... Unless they... Uh, despawn. Uh, like, deal with the problem and we'll take care of the... Okay, yeah, they they despawn, so it's easy enough. But meet you over at the yeah, we'll meet you over at the Cracker Book. YouTube, I'm coming up on the crossroads now. Don't mind the death from earlier, like uh, when I was right about to cut. It it's no biggie. I don't claim to be the best at games. It's like I'm just here to enjoy seven days. That's all I'm really here for, and that's what this series is about. It's like, uh, kind of like, free hell or high water or zombies, we'll get through it. Seems like we got a, you know, a couple folks clean, clear out, though, so. And, oh, you're getting a little close for me. You know, just, uh, it's been a while since I came over and raid here. Yeah, I figured for a quick little loot early in the day, you know, like, well, a nice little looting spot for the day should be. Could be, uh, should be this cracker book, cause, uh, and the days in sweets. 
because, uh, you know, the... It's like, I think it's been well over 10 days since I raided this. Also, don't mind my two pickaxes. Uh, I forgot to merge them, merge some pickaxes. But, so, that's, a, that's just me being forgetful. Um, come on, guys. Give me, give me a spell. Come on. You guys know you want to taste the club. I I will not uh, say no. Here. Make it easy to work with them. Looks like we got a crawler, so we'll take care of you. Come here. No, you want to say hello to me, crawler. I didn't. <laughs> while overnight, I did invest into uh, the last level of Meyer 69er. We'll. One of those, it's like, yo, good to have that finally, and here are a couple merges of pickaxes. Should be able to finally get through 300 hit points in one hit, so things are you know, things are looking up, even despite uh, death itself. Is that all you guys? No, we got Psycho Steve and Marla. Come on. I don't have all day for you. I, I did say I was planning on coming over and spend a good portion of the day. You're done. There we go. I think that's about all of them cleared out for the now. So, car filter, we'll just... Here's hoping I get a... a... Oh, hello, nurse. Didn't know you were running the counter right now, so... We'll just take care of her really quickly, so... Come here. Oh, great, the, the club is, the club is, uh, out of durability. That's a shame. Um, great. Oh, boy, I need a little bit of iron, so. There we go, that'll do me for 100 iron, so. Reinforced club, we'll just make a freshie. Just gotta wait a second for it. I would have made a barbed club, um, or maybe hit a spike club if I get the uh, get the schematic for it, because I don't have the schematic for the old spike club. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Come here. There you go. At least I don't think I have the spike club. No, that's like the one schematic I'm missing in the game. Hopefully get a spike club schematic. Starting off fairly decent with the uh, schematic and a and the challenge for take out some lumberjacks with a fire axe so not too bad alrighty we got Bob out here come here come here you know you want to take care of him really quickly there you go smack on the head he'll he'll learn his lesson eventually probably won't um, bookcases, more paper, we use for shotgun shells, more schematics for armor and all that, and, which reminds me, I should make, remake my iron armor at the very least to have it be, uh, doing something, at least. More paper, and we got even more bookshelves to search here. To get a pistol book. This place really feels like giving me paper today, though. Um, we'll just search up the last couple books here. We're flying through these fairly quickly. Kind of weak on the... Wow, really nothing in these. <laughs> For searching. Come on. Shotgun slug schematic. Well, two of them, actually. Really not much in the... The, uh, Spike Club schematic proceeds to elude me. It, it likes doing that to me. But, yeah, it's really not that... It's just kind of, I'll just make a bar club, it's like... The day I find it, it's like, I feel like the, uh, the Iron Clubs, well, no, the Spike Club is gonna be my, kind of, MacGuffin, like, the, the red herring of this series, where it's like, 
I'll be looking everywhere for it, but the game just ref will refuse to give it to me. It was like this in uh, older series with the with uh, Get Rich or Die. Like I had the I had the old. Uh, all right, what'd you look? A wrench. I had the uh, where I was looking for the gas cans <laughs> gas can recipe for for a long for however long, and it never gave it to me. And uh, yeah, you know, hey, another decent wrench. But um. Looking pretty good on that for the old, uh, Cracker Book. I don't think I ever read the back part of this. Cardboard box has nothing. You just have paper and iron for me. Auger schematic. I already knew that one, but not to just read it. It'll probably come in handy at some point. A little bit of lead. And we'll take out the back office. Uh, we'll just raid into there. SMG schematic. Just read it. And... We'll just break into the safe. I'm not gonna cut here because the, it takes a... It takes a... It doesn't take too long anymore with the, uh, the steel pickaxe. It's just one... You know, it's so nice about having steel tools in this version. And shotgun receiver. I'll take that to improve my shotgun. I'm wondering if I left anything here um, a long ago when I decided to head off for what is now our current town. I don't know. Uh, dumpster. A little bit of gunpowder. Uh, okay. What you what you got for me? You got some. I uh, got leather duster and all that, which is pretty nice. Just scrap that down for the time being. My old, this is my original bedroll and campfire, but um, the we got the old book bag which uh, has some stuff in it with like a flashlight. Not really looking for that much in it. Yeah, you can see that I left some stuff in here. At the very least, I'll take the the magnum ammo and the and the lead and the and all this. Like, there's some stuff I can take with me. But you can see it's like, uh... I didn't really leave much. I tried... I tried to take as much as I could with me. And it's like, here we are, back with a mini bike, you know, and like... And 12 deaths later. But, let's... <laughs> it's just one of those, like, you know, kind of coming back to our roots. And if you don't believe me in YouTube, it's like, go look at, you know, go look at, um, episode one of this series, because, like, we came to this, we came to this crossroad, and this cracker book was here for, was our home for, uh, a couple days. I remember being around here. Let's just check out the old, um, the good old, uh, um, days in suites here. Just gotta break through really quickly. We're getting closer and closer to having that 300 hit point damage, but here we'll check out the office and we'll just read this for the read these for mechanical parts at the very least. You know, only two hits now with the uh, nice wrench on it. Only one register has some dukes in it. It will scrap that up and. Before I get too uh, hog wild here, we'll go and take a look at all the. We'll just throw some stuff in here. I think that's the only magnum ammunition I even have, like in this save. So, okay, we'll just run up and take a look and and. Uh, you know, like, there's a lot to read in here, like, uh, in terms of the old, uh, this is also the area where I found the, uh, the toilet pistol, so, well, first toilet pistol of the series, so it's one of those that, there's a lot here for me, and it's like, uh, you know, a lot of good here, so, um, just keep on raiding through here, and, because if anything, it'll at least give us some resources, maybe even, maybe even a recipe or two. 
We're leveling up our scheduling and everything like that. I don't think we'll rate absolutely everything, but uh, we'll we'll probably at least give uh, most of it a good raid. Just let's scrap that and that puffer jacket is sort of worth a good amount of money to me, so we'll eventually sell that to the trader. Whoop! Excellent. I started chopping the door, but we didn't need to do that. All the doors inside the hotels are unlocked. Which makes sense, because usually outside doors are locked on motels and everything like that. What you got in here? And you know, like, you can get a lot of clothes, yeah. If you're fortunate enough, you can find plenty of, um... You can find medical supplies, like the... Vitamins there, painkillers, you can find toilet pistols if you're really lucky. I was very fortunate to be able to find that. Actually, take a look in here to see what's, what's hiding behind this uh, urban door. A couple storage lockers. And more... For me, right now, it's like just giving me leather and all that junk. And so... I think there's at least a safe in one of these. Just throw you out, and... I do want to remind you folks on YouTube, yo, if you do want to watch a series uh, live and, and you know, be able to chat with, chat with me, you can do so by clicking the link on this on the description of this video, and you can... And it'll take you straight to my Twitch channel. Streaming three three hours, of, about three and a half hours a day for seven days at the moment, and we're doing, uh, I do it about three days a week, so... And if you do come over and follow, that means a lot to me. Oh, just... But anyways, we're just getting through here, and... Here's a kid, too, and continue with this uh, raid, so... I'll just, I'll just scrap that. Yeah, we're finding better stuff around here. I think it's more of the same old, same old, at least. For this, uh... For this hotel. Kind of like... Just the same rooms over and over again. But at least, it, you know, I at least want to see if I can find something in here. Like, we already found a puffer jacket, so. It, is, it seems like it's raining in, outside in this world. And. Yeah, like, like I say, it's. You just kind of find a lot of the same old, same old. I gotta at least boil the water down later once I get back to your base. And hey, even the store is unlocked. This is kind of a little unusual, but especially like an armor door like that, it's like you wouldn't expect it to be. Uh, this, eh, that the floor is broken out, but I think we'll do the last a uh, little bit of the side. We actually got an airdrop. Um, one second. Well, I just scrap that down. We'll just. Scrap the clothes down, too. Let's check out where that's at. That is actually near the original the spawn of this world. It's like, uh, this crossroads is like where I kind of came seeking shelter on day one, but... This is... but... That's spawning near the original spawn of the world. Just the same locker room. You know, leveling up our mining tools. Give me a second while I run over to the... Well, darn. That's a... That's a leg sprain. Oh well. Just make a quick little splint. These are so much easier to make on uh, this version than a uh, PC. PC, uh, I think it's like the same... Well, basically the same ingredients, except you need duct tape for it. Makes it a little bit more annoying to craft, but like I say, give me a second and I'll be over at the airdrop. And we're coming up on airdrop now. Let's uh, just pull it up here and let's see what we what we get out of it. Come on, something good. AK-47 receiver, SMG receiver, and some medical supplies. Um, let's we'll throw that out. What level is my SMG receiver? Level 171. 
I'm actually freezing a little bit. We'll just throw on the little puffer coat there. But, uh, good little uh, airdrop radio. Good to see, uh, although it's like, uh, the AK receiver is, it's not a bad find to see, it's just that, uh, it's one of those finds for me where I'm like, wow, I just want a, you know, I was kind of wanting a, something a little bit better. You know, something like another AK-47 part, you know, but anyways, I'm just going to do a little bit of resource collecting off camera here, and I'm going to, you know, while driving back over at the base, and, you know, we'll, we'll take a look at getting more, and I'll do some more base upgrades, so I will update you in a little bit, YouTube. Well, YouTube, I'm, I'm still do I'm just performing upgrades here on the new base, uh, uh, just working on the old, uh, I got most of the wood upgrades done and all this good stuff. I've started placing in the hatches, and now you're really starting to see my, my grand, my kind of grand scheme. I'm, I still gotta upgrade some hatches here, but the plan is, like, fight zombies in here with the garage doors closed. I still have to upgrade this one to, with my forged iron, but once that hunt and uh, these hatches will be here just uh, in case, like, a, a zombie gets too close and uh, they get squeezed through the they get squeezed through the blocks. And uh, yeah, I'd say that hmm, it's been a pretty successful day today, aside from the little death. But I'm gonna leave this episode here. Have a great day and take care.